Hello everyone and welcome back to another vlog. I just got done filming some content, that's why my things are all set up back there. It is Friday night, it's around 8.30. I'm just going to wash off this makeup now. I feel, I don't know why this makeup is just making me feel so gross. Um, I'm probably going to do some extractions on my face because my pores are super clogged. Um, and then I kind of want to whiten my teeth because I went to the dentist this week and got a cleaning. And then they gave me this cleaning kit that I'm supposed to keep in the fridge. Go. Opulence, go. So kind of want to do that. I also would actually really like to do some self-tanner this weekend. So hopefully I can um, find some time to do that. Actually, before I shower, I want to show you guys. I got John and I... Um, some hokas for the gym um they are supposed to be like super super good for your feet if you guys have been following me for a while you'll know that um i seen this guy named mobility mechanic if you're from michigan probably know who he is he recommends um he also recommended the new balances that i always wear to the gym i don't know if you guys have seen them in videos or not super ugly but ever since i started wearing them i've never had a single problem while I work out, because um, I used to have super bad hip pain and it literally just went away. So those are more for lifting and then these are for more walking and cardio. So let me show you. I had to get men's size seven and a half because they were out of women's sizes. So this is them, super spongy at the bottom, cute. John wanted all black. I really hate the all black, but you know, whatever makes him happy. <laughs> So I just wanted to try these on and let you guys know how they are. Because the first day I tried them on, I had no socks on. So I want to double check and make sure they fit me properly. So this is them. Honestly, they're not as ugly as I thought they would be. I mean, they're obviously not the cutest, but they're not that bad. They're just like a little snug, I feel like, around my actual foot. And I have pretty narrow feet. So I'm just going to have to walk around with them and see what I should do about this size. So I just tried them on, loosened up the laces, and they're still feeling a little tight. I got seven and a half in men's, which I'm supposed to technically be a size seven in men's. So I don't know if my foot's growing or what's wrong with me, but they are just a little too snug. I don't know. I just don't like to have super tight feet or shoes on my feet. It's just uncomfortable to me. And obviously I would never wear these with jeans. So do not be alarmed. <laughs> Someone is making us some Aperol spritz. Watch, don't your, mind. watch your eyes. Don't mind our Aperol container. Nice. We don't have regular club soda, so we're just opting out for this. Put light this and um, I don't want too much. Normally I never have drinks, but I'm trying to <laughs> have, or give John some company, I should say. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. John and I went to Starbucks and the holiday cups are officially out. John's is so much cuter. I'm obsessed. This is mine. This is cute too, but John got the um, tall caramel brulee latte and I got the chestnut praline. They had the um, ice sugar cookie drink or something, but that one was sold out and plus it's so cold so i wanted something warm but let's try this i've never tried the chestnut praline oh my god that's so sweet but it's so good no way i can drink all that it'll give me a stomach ache let's try john's oh my god they're both so good John, these are so good. Try them. Boy. Sorry, I got lipstick on yours. And um, we're going to the mall. John needs a new winter coat. We haven't gotten <sighs> him one in years. Tell us what your thoughts are. Mmm, that's Yummy, sweet. right? Try mine. Mine's really cookie? sweet. Mmm, I like yours better. So good, but so sweet. If yeah, I finish that all, I'll literally have a stomach ache. So now we're getting gas, and then we are headed to the mall. Crazy 
crazy right now. I just got ready. Um, I was, I'm about to crimp my hair, so I thought I would show you guys how I do it. I'm trying to position you guys in the right way. Um, so what I do is I literally split my hair right in half. Guys, this takes me less than five minutes to do. That's why my hair is literally always crimped because it is so quick and easy. And I just take a clip and clip it so I can get the bottom row. And then I take big pieces like this. This is the crimper I use, this Bedhead Wave Artist. I just got it at Target. And I literally, I'm out of breath right now. I go down like this. So quick, so easy. I'm literally done, my whole head, I have a lot of hair. Done in five minutes. But um, my sister and I are going out to brunch with friends today. I'm so excited, I haven't seen them in so long. Our husbands are up north hunting, so we are having ourselves a little girls weekend, hanging out with friends, just doing girly things. But before brunch, I'm just getting ready because I have to film a YouTube video and some TikToks and things of that sort. And I haven't vlogged in so long. I've been so bad about it. You guys will see some clips that I'm gonna put together in this vlog, obviously, from like the past week or so. But I've literally been doing nothing for you guys to see. The vlog is just gonna be boring. Like I've been working so much lately. I've been um, doing a lot of YouTube stuff and just like, if I'm not working at my job, I'm filming TikToks, YouTube videos, editing them, grocery shopping, like just doing my everyday things, going to the gym, just trying to get my shit done, be the best version of me and starting to drain me a little bit. I feel like I never ever can catch a break, like between always working and then this and then trying to have a social life and see family and, you know, be the best that I could be in every aspect of my life is just a lot like i beat myself up over it sometimes but i'm like most people that i know never cook dinner i cook dinner every single night i make my lunch every single night i go to the gym every single day i'm working a full-time job plus youtube and so like i'm hard on myself and i'm like not perfect in every department but it's like i'm only one human being and i can only do so much i feel like living a healthy lifestyle is kind of a full-time job in itself too because let me tell you, it is a lot of work, but it's so worth it because I feel amazing. And obviously, health is the most important thing ever. I don't know why I'm rambling right now, but yeah, I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna get ready. And I thought I would show you guys how I curl my hair. Because why not? It's so cute and easy. And um, now I'm done with the bottom layer. Let's take the clip. Clip I just crimped so it doesn't mix up. So yeah, that's what's been going on with me. Holidays are coming. Um, next week is Thanksgiving, which I'm excited about because I have a couple days off of work from there. And then my mindset is just so crazy because I'm like, okay, perfect, I have a couple days off. I'm gonna film so much content, but it's like, let's chill, let's reset let's spend time with the family i feel like i never have like a real day off on my days off i'm doing my youtube stuff so i never get a day to just literally do nothing i'm either grocery shopping meal prepping doing youtube stuff like it's just always something so i feel like i'm just gonna take a couple days off of doing stuff 24 7 during the holidays and just really recoup so I'm excited for that. Not complaining at all, obviously. This is what I want to do. This is what I chose to do. But just letting you guys, or just giving you guys an update on what I've been up to and how I've been feeling. Yeah, so I also need a haircut. But I'm gonna finish up my hair and then I will see you guys in a bit. <laughs> Brunch with friends. Oh my God, we're gonna be Are you okay? Can you guys not be dramatic? Came to Sanders Chocolate. 
They want to be recorded so bad. I thought you were going to do it. I don't know what we're doing here, but we're going to get some ice cream. It's so freaking cute in here. We got the peanut butter paradise. Yummy. Neat and I went to Target and at home and I got the cutest little Christmas candle from Target. I love this um, like Christmas tree smelling scent. And then it also doubles as a little decoration. So cute. And then I just got this plain white t-shirt because I've seen it all over TikTok and it looks so nice. So I thought I'd give it a try because I've gotten rid of like all my plain white tees. And then at home, I just got these little beads for my Christmas tree because I don't have any more ribbon. It's like all old and stuff. So I thought this would look super cute instead of ribbon. So pale, it's like not normal. Um, I just got back from Target and I returned that white shirt that I showed you guys earlier because it was super sheer and just like not the quality I wanted it to be. So I returned it. And then I walked around and I found these cute little Christmas towels I'm gonna put like on my oven. And then I just got this delicious smelling iced sugar cookies candle. It smells so, so, so good. I'm excited to like that. It smells like literal iced cookies. And then we stopped at Kroger. We got a couple things. I didn't get much because it's Thanksgiving week and we're not gonna be obviously eating at home as much. So we're gonna be making steaks one day, which I didn't get with like baked potato. These mangoes look good. I got a golden papaya. I wanted to try it. Some chicken breast um, for dinner and lunch, whatever. Um, eggs, blueberries, some coffee creamer. I like to have sauerkraut in the morning with breakfast, just like as a side. And then I also like cottage cheese with breakfast. And I get these little um, rices to have, right to go just to have for like an easy, simple, like side, whatever. And then I got this turkey bacon, which I love. And then just some lemons. And just kept it simple. Gonna obviously grab some more stuff throughout the week when needed, but don't really have a full menu this week. So I went to my dad's house today and I've been wanting a leather bomber jacket forever now. And he had this one from like probably 20 or 30 years ago. And it's like a little distressed and vintage and I love it. It's obviously like big and a little too long but I feel like I can still get away with it. And it's like so cute. I was gonna pay like so much money for one and I just was like, I'm not gonna do it. And I'm glad I didn't because this one's perfect. I cannot believe I found this. So excited about that. Dinner after a long, hard leg day. Yummy. Finally convinced John to get rid of the all black dad hokas and get some black and white ones. Show us the hokas. Sick, dude. Okay, try them on for us. You don't gotta hold them up for 30 minutes. They've never been worn. You can put them on over here. Oh. Cool. Also just had some tea after steak. Help us digest our tea. And we're chilling. So much better than the all black. We hate an all black sneaker. What do you think? Do you like them? I mean, they're pretty cool. I mean, they're not. I guess they'll be comfortable for the gym, but. I mean, yeah, they're not for looks. You like? Yeah, they're not bad. They look like. Like I'm gonna go walk around the mall. They don't look bad, honestly. Really? I swear. They're like so, like, like I'm wearing freaking. They're comfy, that's for sure. Heck yeah.